regular revenue agent's examination during an income or a payroll tax audit, they'll ask you for specific documents. It's important to make a decision long before the revenue agent asks you for those documents, whether those are the documents that you want to turn over or not, depending on what the facts and circumstances are in the case. So that's why a tax attorney would go in, do an analysis to see what are the issues in the case and how best to defend them. Eventually, it will come down to the point that you have to turn over certain documents. The documents that you're required to turn over and that the IRS can collect by a summons or subpoena if you don't voluntarily provide to them are documents that are prepared in the regular course of business. When you prepare an income tax return, you do your regular financial accounting. Those are documents prepared in the ordinary course of business. Um, um, tax return preparation documents, such as financial statements, a balance sheet, income statement, those are documents prepared in the ordinary course of business and they are discoverable either through an information document request form from the IRS, through a summons or later subpoena. The documents that you don't want to turn over to the IRS are the documents that are prepared with your tax attorney. Uh, documents that are prepared in anticipation of litigation. You're not required to turn those over to the Internal Revenue Service.